blessing. Yeah, baby girl, you're a blessing, blessing. My channel. My name is Valencia, and you're watching Styling with V, a we focus on fashion, beauty, lifestyle. But my main focus helps the invertible triangle for styling in Harlem. If this is something that you're interested in, too, please subscribe to my channel. On today's video, it's going to be a collective haul of pieces that I picked up in the last current month, this month, last month, but didn't know where I wanted to put it in in a video. And I I wanted to give you a chance to get some of these pieces because I think one of the items that I have is on clearance. So I got this cute top that I got from Pretty Little Things. I got some camo uh, joggers that I got from Fashion Nova. I got some basic tank from Zara. I have a Zara jumpsuit and a, just a sheer button-up top that I got from H&M. But I don't want to get to rambling. Like I say, let's get to styling these pieces. Okay, the first outfit that we have is this denim corset that I got from Pretty Little Thing. I got this in a size 18 because I'm pretty busty. And I ordered in the 14 and I ordered in the 16 and it just was not fitting. And the 18 is kind of big up here, but it fits good in all the other places. And I paired them up with these cargo camo jeans that I got from Fashion Nova. And I also paired it up with my Zara sling back heels. So how do you feel about this outfit? And I would pair it up. Also, I would still keep the metallic. You could do a orange. You could, like, camo really now is really a neutral. That's like, I feel like animal print is a neutral. So, I would pair this up with this. And this is a nice brunch outfit, going out with your friends, going out with your boo, anything. But this is very cute. And baby, Valencia gonna wear these metallic heels out this spring and summer. So how do you feel about this? And one thing I want to tell you about this corset, it's not a scrunchy back. It has a zip in the back. So, and it's a real true denim. So how do you feel about this look? And I got these pants in an extra large. The large was too small and the one X was too big. All right, on to the next one. Okay, we're still working with the camo joggers. But then I got a bright color vest that I got from Express in a size extra large. I keep the two buttons up and I leave these unbuttoned and we're still working with the metallic heels metallic bracelet don't mind me i still got my apple i just realized that i had it on and we're still going to pair it up with this metallic bag and this is a way that you can dress it up elevate it so how do you feel about Right, on to the next one. That 
don't mind me, I'm just loving this outfit. I have been always the type to love rompers or jumpsuits, but since I'm so triangle, I have to get it to fit my shoulders if it's so big at the bottom. So I picked up this little cute little number from Zara, and how cute is it? And when I looked at the description, it said it ran big. So I'm normally probably an extra large in Zara because it's no zippers, okay? No zippers, I'm not fitting in at all. So, and then I, then I think that it was belted. And that's one thing about us being vertical triangle. Belted looks so good on us because it's going to snatch our waist in the smallest part of our waist, which for me is right under my butt. And they say they ran big, so I knew the bottoms ran big, so it's more flowy. And then that I have a stomach, it can kind of camouflage it. And I like this, and then to have the silver hardware of the pocket, more like a cargo style. And I paired it up still with my metallic, keeping the metallic going on. And I paired it up with the metallic plain back heels. So how do you feel about this look? And it has pocket, which we love. So how do you feel about this outfit? I tend to like rompers more than I like jumpsuits because rompers allows me to show some leg where jumpsuits don't and it looks like it swallows me. So I tend to go for rompers, but I love jumpers. It's just, it's not patterning on my body. And when you want to go for a romper, you want more of a wider leg. So it gives you more of volume at the bottom. And then the belt just kind of cinches you in at the waist. So then it makes it look like you have curves at the bottom. And I will pair it up still with my metallic bag. Baby, we're going to get some wear out of this. And how do you feel? about this one. And this is a cute little brunch with your girls. If you want to wear this on vacation, if you want to wear this on a date with your pool, a day party, this is very cute. And it's linen, so it's breathable. So how do you feel about this look? I like this little number. Like that is roomy at the bottom. I know I have to be self-conscious about my belly line. You can still put on you some shapewear and snatch you up some more. We want to be snatched up some more. But I really love this. All right, on to the next one. Now, this is the next look, probably my favorite look, because I love the metallic trend, but I wanted to opt something that was just going to be soft friendly where I could get more wear. And I wasn't going to get a lot of wear out of metallic dress because I might wear it once and not wear it again. Or some shiny pants or the shorts, and I just didn't want that. So when I just seen the top, a metallic shiny top, I was like, oh, that would be cute. I can wear that with so many different things. So I could wear it with my a denim jacket, I could wear it with a blazer. And then I got all my metallic jewelry on. And I opt to tone this metallic down with some black. And that's a way that you can tone the metallic down with something dark. And I also, then I went back to the, with the metallic heels. And I also opt for my Steve Madden bag with studs with the metallic and the metallic chain. So tell me, how do you feel about this look? I really like this look and it's so effortless. And this is probably something besides getting the metallic chain, this is something you can ask in your closet. 
closet and you can wear this so many ways and if you want to if you're in a work setting you can still wear this you can just put like a black blazer on or a blazer or something like that to tell so in your work setting so how do you feel about this look all right on to our last look y'all know i couldn't leave this video without a dress down look so i got the idea because everybody's been doing this monochromatic which i love but i like more of the monochromatic that's not matchy matchy i like the it's like in the cream linen brown linen tan i like that look more and so i was i had the idea so i think zara came out with High neck, high neck tank, and I got it in a cream and a charcoal color. And then H&M came out with another collection, and I picked up this tan button up um, in a size medium because they was out of large. But I'm glad I picked up the medium because they did say it was oversized, and it fits me well. And then I did have these shorts from Bananas Republic Factory in a size 12. And these kind of run big so you can size down. And I will pair them up with these gold sandals that I got from Sheen to keep in the tan and the brown family. But I will also pair it up with my gold Aldo bag. And I feel like this is a really chic, elevated look that you didn't have to do too much. You didn't have to spice it. Yeah. And this this look, you can go grocery shopping, you can, you, you can go to parent-teacher conference and you already look the part because you're comfortable and you're elevated with basic pieces that you probably already have in your closet. So how do you feel about this look? I really like this look. I feel like this look is more me every day, Valencia. But how do you like this look? And this is just a way to make your basics work for your wardrobe. And that's what I've been learning. So ever since before I started getting on YouTube, and I used to have so much color in my closet. And whenever it was time to go somewhere, I had nothing to wear. But now that I put so much neutral in my closet, it feels like I got endless outfits to wear. So. Now I love shopping my closet because I can go in and actually find something to put on. So tell me which look was your favorite. Now you've come to the end of my video and I want to thank you for watching. If you're not subscribed, please hit that subscribe button. I love you guys. Bye.